Hi, I'm Mr Sam the Allotment Man and today we're going to plant some stuff. So then, what are we going to plant? Well, uh, oh, me and Chester. Chester? Well, that's not very nice. Come here. Are you going to come and help? You're not going to help. Right, okay. So what we're going to plant today, we're going to plant some of these. We're going to plant some uh, radish, okay, and we're going to plant some lettuce. So uh, we got these from the gardening centre because where we go out here in Waimundum, in Wyndham, uh, we have to go and get our doggy food, and the doggies uh, get their food from a garden centre around the corner, so that's quite good. So uh, on the back, it's got lots of instructions of what to do. And we're going to follow it now. I would just tell you, right, uh, when you're doing these, don't rip them off the top, okay, because you usually go over the instructions and stuff um, and you don't know what you're doing. And uh, at the bottom, you just peel them up like this. There you go. And you put a sellotape on the, on the end of it and do that. So there you go. So um, what we're going to do, we're going to do our <coughs> radishes first. So outdoors directly where are they are to crop one and a half centimetres deep directly into finely prepared soil uh, which has already been watered done that okay um, allow nine inches 23 centimetres between rows early sowing may benefit from cloche protection seedlings usually appear seven to ten days there you go so uh, that's what we're going to do so we're going to do this and I've got some um, what are these these were kebab sticks kebab sticks are we going to use them to mark the end of our lines so uh, Let's get on with it. Oh. So here we go. So we're gonna. Oh, you can come to have a look now. There you are. So we're going to plant our bits now. Oh, I've got some tools over here. Now, I found these. These are some plastic ones, so it doesn't matter if they're left out. Now, uh, what we've done, we put some compost in here. Okay. Um, and the dogs have been uh, making it their lovely sunbed. Um, so I've made it into. An impenetrable castle. Uh, just drill holes into the wood and then bang some bamboo in it. So there you are. So that's it. So um, when they say this is uh, being watered, I've watered it a lot. But if we go down underneath, look, it gets dry again quite quickly because the weather is so warm. So what I'll do, I'll put these in, and later on this evening, I will give it another water. So then the sun won't take up all the um the moisture so so we're going to make a line we're going to get our stick like this so it's said to go about a centimeter and a half down which is about that i suppose so i'll make my rows here so we're going to have half you know, do a load of radishes this is all experimental i don't know if this is all going to go well or not but we'll see so this would be about right okay so we're going to do our radishes here so we get quite a few radishes. Uh, there we are. You can have a look. So we're going to pop them in here. Goosh, goosh. Now we're going to expect some of these not to work. So um, just put them not too finely, but they're about a centimetre apart, something like that. I don't know what it says on the packet, but that's what I'm doing. Oh, there's a buzzy thing. You get it? Right. And there. there you go, Chester. What do you think? You planted anything before? No? Yeah. Like that. Chester's helping out. So they're all going in there. And then we'll cover them over. Like that. But before we cover them over, we put a stick on. Gent. Now you get quite a lot. You get a thousand seeds in here. So we will think now usually what I might do is do some like now and then some in a couple of weeks and so you get a succession but um, you might try try doing that but we haven't got a lot of room so we're just gonna get enough well just to see if it all goes really go do some work I'm not sure if this will work because at the moment because we're on Good Friday we've got really nice weather um, 
but then it's going to get cold again. So hopefully we won't get a frost. There we go, just using the hands like that. And that's it. Now these grow really quickly, so we should see some, some uh, stuff coming up soon. If you've got lots of kids at home and stuff, this sort of stuff um, is good to grow because the children see things happening quickly. Because you know what kids are like. It's like, uh, are they up there? Are they up yet? And then they soon lose interest. So we're just going to do that like that. There you go. So uh, that's the branches is done. Now we're going to do the lettuces. So here we are. Ooh, excuse me, on the other side. Now, with the lettuces, um, let's just see how deep they're going to go. Uh, 1.5 deep. Do you think they're the same? Oh, they're the same. There you go. Um, allow 30 centimetres between rows. Uh, do, 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 do. There you go. So we're going to do that. But we're going to put a few in and we can pick them out if they're not very good. Now I'm only going to do uh, one row, I think, to begin with this week. And then next week I'm going to put another row in. Now these are tiny seeds, so they come with another little thing. Then I'm going to put another row in because we don't want them all to come together. Radishes aren't so bad because you use a few of them at a time, but you only use, you know, you don't use lettuces. Oops, millions in here. No chester, you can't eat them. Right. Now, we're going to give these a little bit of a sprinkle. Um, and the ones, you know, we can always pick out ones that don't work because we might get a frost or something. So that's it. That's what, don't eat the bamboo. That's it. There you go, I'm going to cover them back over. Oh, sugar, forgot. Put them in. There we are. We've got all the bits again. There we are. There you go, and there's our lettuces. And we'll stick them back in there. There you go. Fold them over and put them in there. That's it. There you go. So, put them out of sight and we'll just put that in there just to remind us what's happening on. So there we go. So that is it. So um come here Chester. Come here Chester. Come here. Go and sit down. Ooh. So me and Chester the gardener, we've done rather well. It's your first time gardening, isn't it? It's his first time gardening, so that's all wonderful. So it was only a short one today, um, because I've got lots of other DIY bits and pieces to do. Um Dad will probably do an update next time, okay, because he's very busy as well at the moment. So uh, that's it. We'll let you know what goes on with it. Um, hope you're having a lovely Easter. Um, well, as good as can be expected in these times. I hope you're all well. Um, uh, that's it, really. Not much more to be said. So stay safe and keep your distance from everybody else. And um, uh, from me and Chester, happy growing. See you later. Is that right?